All right, so I picked up a new windscreen for the Harley. I'm six foot one, and I'm getting quite a bit of buffeting from the the factory windscreen on the Lowrider ST. Here in New Zealand, it's kind of a pain to get like Memphis Shades one or any of the other popular ones. You kind of have to order them from overseas. The exchange rate's really bad. So I ended up getting the Light Smoke 10 inch one from Harley, the genuine version. Um, and it was only like $410 New Zealand with the discount you get uh, from the dealer when you buy a Harley. And they had it in stock, so that's what I picked up. It seems pretty obvious how to install it. I would apologize for how dirty my garage is, but uh, I'd be lying because I'm not actually sorry. And then we'll take it for a ride and uh, see if it makes much of a difference. So here it is. Um, the code on it, uh, part number is uh, 574-00505. And it is quite a bit taller. Looks nice quality. So uh, it's kind of an angle you can see properly factory one and then it's probably a little bit hard to see on camera all right I'm gonna install it so they're just um, t27 star drive the other good thing is that the factory one comes with the um, rubber grommets as well as far as I could tell all the ones from aftermarket that I've seen anyway I could definitely be wrong but um, they didn't you have to take the grommets off this one so it makes it a little bit easier to change be able to see the difference a little bit clearer there. And there it is. Hopefully you guys can see. I'm going to take it out now anyway. The only difference between this and the other ones I've seen online from other brands is that they have kind of a little scoop up, which I know does make a difference. So hopefully this one still works pretty well. But So the screen's here. Um, and right now I'm holding the camera like eye height. So it should... Most of the air should go straight over my head and hopefully you guys um, will be able to see through better when I'm doing like rides and stuff as well. Anyway, I'm going to chuck the helmet on now and I uh, will take it for a little spin. Here we are, hopefully you guys can see it. Um, after the little ride I've taken it for out of my house to get it here on the side of the road, it makes a massive difference. I just wanted to stop and uh, let you guys know kind of what it looks like out of my messy garage. Hopefully it comes across the seating position and where my, so I'm six foot one, like 186 centimeters, and my eye line is basically right in line with the top of it. So I, I'm, I can still kind of see the car in front of me above this um, but I can see through it great anyway the wind makes a massive difference I don't know if it comes across on camera but uh, it sound it, it's much much better I know I should be wearing proper riding gear it's all at work unfortunately and uh, I'm just going for a quick one to test it and uh, I'll be real careful Coming into autumn here in New Zealand, getting some nice colours and nice sunsets. Oh man, it's it's so different. Like I was getting hit basically right in the eyes with wind before. Now I can't feel anything. The wind kind of starts. It's kind of just hitting the tip of my the top of my helmet. You guys let me know what the view's like as well, because I did raise my um, help my camera up a little bit so you could see over the factory screen obviously now you're looking straight through it so hopefully it still looks fine because there's really not much I can do about it yep Harley Davidson genuine 10 inch light smoke screen I guess the main thing is it comes down to you and whether you like the look of it but um, just the fact that they had it in stock and it was 400 bucks that's New Zealand dollars it's, uh, it's pretty sweet. All the ones I looked at were like 400 to 500 US dollars, which is like almost a thousand bucks New Zealand plus shipping. So 
like I'm paying way less than half what I would for one of those fancy aftermarket ones and this actually does the job real well anyway that's pretty much it for this video just a real quick one big thumbs up for this one I didn't think I would like it as much but uh yeah I do I love it and the wind protection is amazing so um yeah I'm stoked anyway I gotta get back to the studio and edit some photos from uh weddings I've done recently so I'll see you guys in the next video